My name is Josephine Campbell. I'm an executive coach. And these days I'm having my coaching sessions with corporate leaders from my home office, which you see here. And we're doing them virtually. And there is a striking theme, which is uncertainty and anxiety. It's not so weird. And it, it varies how people deal with it. Some people are fine with it, but a lot of people get anxiety from uncertainty. And what is striking is also that most people feel like they're alone with this feeling, or they're the only ones who have to deal with anxiety. And you're not. It's not a lonely affair. Actually, 12% of the European population is some kind of treatment for anxiety. Um, in UK, the number is, or were, 8.9 million in 2018. And in Denmark, where I'm based, it's 350,000. It's a lot of people. And in these times with crisis, the number is raising, for sure. So um, you need to manage it or deal with it in some way. It would be normal way to try to numb the, feel, the unpleasant feelings, um, to just watch a lot of movies, uh, drink alcohol, something else that numbs your feelings. Most of the leaders I work with, they have a lot of courage, so now is the time to use that courage to face what you're up against and find something else to rely on than thinking that you can plan and manage Sometimes it can be nice to have someone to talk to about it, so you are able to take yourself out of the equation if it's something that you're very engaged with. Because it could be hard to deal with problems that you're personally very vested in. Not that it's bad to have a heart, it's not. But it can being engaged can make it more difficult to see things from different perspectives. And then, of course, you need to be at your best. You probably already used a lot of your personal resources. So if you haven't already looked at checking in on how you can refill your personal energy tank, I would advise you to do that. So feel free to write me a question. Please give me a thumbs up or thumbs down on the video. Um, I'd love to hear what you think about it. And you know, I'm here to help. So you're welcome to put yourself in contact. Wish you good luck. Thank you.